Hello friends, we might as well oh, do a daily video because we're all, I have my hair done. I always like to film on days where I actually do my hair. I just filmed our Christmas, oh I do need to do that for you. Yeah, don't we'll go it tonight. Yeah, well, not now. I don't want to do it now. I just filmed our Christmas decoration video because everything is decorated and he just got home. C tell me your good news. Oh, good news. So I had a rattle in my suspension for a long time. It was so annoying that I won't drive his car, you guys. It is so annoying. That's been did one you bad take thing. it to get that fixed or did yeah, you take it? That's to what I took it. Well, I didn't know if you took it to get the insurance inspection. I didn't no, know which I one. No, I had to schedule that. No, no, I, I got it. So then they had to tighten something up. Well, you took um, it in and you just thought you were like making the appointment, right? Well, they were going to see what it was and then I figured they would then make an appointment to fix it. Right. Or to diagnose it more. Right. But they got it in there and tightened something up and then drove it again and they're like, yeah. Okay, it's all fixed. It's all fixed. And I'm like, hell Two man. plus years of that thing Well, it's one of those around. like minor things you got to get to. Yeah. He can't, he couldn't get to it in like part wise. He couldn't get to the inner part well, of the car. I, I don't know. I thought I'm I very tied happy. Up the one thing. Yeah, it's nice. Now the car is so quiet. It's a hybrid. Yeah. So it's super nice. Yeah. I'm very happy for him because if I had to drive that car every day. On the highway, you didn't hear it. I'm on the highway most. Well, I, it, it bothered me. It bothered me too. <laughs> and Kaylee won't drive it either. Now that she has her driver's license, she's like, I'm taking mom's car. Dad's is too loud. And his is a hybrid, which was so frustrating. But it, we, won't, no one... we won't tell her it's fixed. No, we are telling her because <laughs> I want her to drive your car more than mine. Anyway, you can see our holiday decorations are all done. If you want to check out that video, we have a lot of things to do today he's already accomplished a lot and it's already not only 9 30. yeah i was out of bed and gone before you even got out of bed i was awake oh okay. I, kept a awake. I don't awake. need to get up at 7 30. there's no need to, for me to get up at 7 30. okay okay i went out to the bus with our one daughter we don't need to have a parade of parents at the bus stop i don't need to go with you to hold your hand you don't have to hold my hand okay there's just things to do I, in the house i'm hungry and you clearly live a nice life it's all right it's all right <laughs> <laughs> You're hungry? Are we gonna do something and go out or should I make some food here? He, see, this is part of my problem. It's, it's tempting, but it's only 9.30, so I... I do there, we have errands to run so we'll get lunch? Yeah, but it's only 9.30, so we need to eat breakfast now. We need to eat breakfast here. Okay. I, I already so have, look, this is why I'm being good. I have my, my pitcher out to make my protein drink. Okay. I'm so we're eating here. Eggs on the pan that's ham. still not cleaned out. That's disgusting. And I clean it every time. Mm. He doesn't. Yeah. All right. I. You wouldn't know because you don't cook. <laughs> Thanks to Abby. All right. I am. Yes, I'm going to wear this shirt today, but I am like dying of heat from filming that little video. So I'm going to take this off for a little bit while I get some breakfast. And then we have holiday shopping to do for Thanksgiving. I just have like grocery shopping and Costco shopping to do for that. So he's going to join me. And then we need to go and look for some Christmas presents for myself. <laughs> He needs to get ideas of what to get me for Christmas, and we have an idea. I need to go see if we can do I, it. I need to know your size. My size? You're not buying me clothes. No, 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 your ring size. Oh, 13 and a half. That's, that, that's one. It's literally in my shopping cart on Amazon, just but so not you know. The size. I literally added the one. No, you have two of them in there, and oh. all it says is different sizes. It doesn't tell me what size. Oh. Thank you. Okay. Not that I would know because I'm not getting it for you. <laughs> He's so bad at surprises. That's because you're so bad at... <laughs> I literally like leave things in my shopping cart on Amazon well, and he still struggles. You get everything you want and and everything's exact. It's, can't, I, I don't get everything I want. You're I look for it. For. I look for a deal and if I see it on a sale, on a deal, on clearance or whatever, I do get it because it's like 90% off or whatever. It, it's, uh, it's your uh, hobbies. They're very okay. specific. Well, we, it's hard to shop we'll, for you. We'll be back. You think you're gonna get enough pies? At least two. At least two? That might get us two. This is it. No, you can't eat the second one. This is like Thanksgiving. One is Thanksgiving. So you can only eat the one now. I'm not coming back for pie. <laughs> so we found a super yummy treat for Thanksgiving, but we gotta keep it hidden. Yeah, we'll keep it hidden. Yum. I can't eat that, but I'll get it for the girls. All right, sometimes when you're at Costco, you have to make tough decisions on items that you've already bought. Can't even show you what we have here. It's a Christmas present. It is a cute surprise. It is very cute and I can't resist not getting it, but it means I need to return something else that I've already gotten because this one's better. So I hate returning. When I buy things, it's like definitive, this is what we're doing. And so yeah, I anyway. I can't remember the last time I returned anything. 
No, because I know I'm gonna get it. I'll think about it for a while if I need to, but I won't buy and then return. Otherwise, we just got normal stuff at Costco besides Jason's like two pumpkin pies. And you have to promise. What? You can only eat one of those pies between now so and Thursday. So one's just for me, the other one's for the family? No. <laughs> so Jason snuck these on the bottom rack and scanned it right at the last minute. But then one of them fell off after we checked out and now he's run back in trying to find it. <laughs> it serves him right for trying to sneak it in. He's mad because he had to go back and get another one. And I wouldn't because it's not mine. Oh, he got another one. He's kind of mad. Okay, he's putting away the cart. He got mad at me because I told him that if he needed another one and we sat in customer service, they're just gonna tell him to go back into the back and get another one. And he did. Are you okay now that you got your chocolate? I am fine. That look, not uh, uh, end of conversation. Uh, end of conversation. Oh, yes. you get the last dig in? I do. All right, we went to Safeway. Oh, that's not Safeway. Um, while we're waiting to get into Verizon, we need to talk to him about one of our phones and uh, we had a 45 minute wait. So I wasn't gonna do the grocery shopping because I decided Verizon was more important to do with Jason, but kill two birds with one stone. And I'm hoping got all the supplies for holiday baking cooking snacking all that kind of stuff and I even got five things of sodas for all the teenagers when they come over am I not close enough couldn't get my bag close enough to the car for it to open got a whole car load here but I got a whole bunch of sodas good teenagers they're drinking my coke when they come over can't have any of that <laughs> so I had to get some plus I wanted ginger ale for like the holidays like to have for holiday dinners because like we don't drink we don't have alcohol but like what is it, what is it called the sparkling cider or whatever yeah. it is so heavy on your stomach it is like way too much and so ginger ale gives you that feel of the bubbly and it's cute in the glass cup <laughs> but it's, it's a little easier on your stomach and I got coke zero I got uh, ginger ale zero so that one is for me through the holidays I'm gonna have one for um, Thanksgiving dinner and then I'll hang on to it for other little holiday parties or whatever so hopefully the teenagers know not to drink my zero ones anymore all right we've unpacked all of our groceries minus these veggies and it just feels nice to have the fridge all stocked up we have leftovers for tonight we made the world's best mac and cheese for dinner last night so I just went and got a sausage to add to that for dinner and then we'll have some veggies got some carrots to make a roast which is right there so I'm mad that I didn't get two containers of the cottage cheese when I was at Costco I suddenly remembered that we like to make cottage cheese jello for th for Thanksgiving for holidays or whatever so I had to pay two dollars more at the grocery store because I did not want to go back to Costco this week so I had to pay a little bit extra for that there's the mac and cheese back in there lots of veggies I want to do like a veggie tray um, for Thanksgiving and then I got carrots to make the roast like I said we got a little teeny tiny roast I'm hoping to do that tomorrow night for dinner I'm going to pre-make my mashed potatoes probably will do that tomorrow because it will be a no makeup day <laughs> not gonna worry about getting ready tomorrow just because I need to do a lot of editing which is what I'm hopefully gonna do here soon but if I make the potatoes tomorrow for Thanksgiving I might as well use some of them for dinner tomorrow night with the roast kind of do all the prep in one day I've wanted a roast for a really long time and I figured if this is the week for potatoes and carbs <laughs> So just get it all done. I haven't bought potatoes for, wouldn't you say like months? Yeah, it's been a while. Yeah, and I, you know, I, know, I don't think the kids are missing them by any means. They don't crave potatoes like I do, but I'm craving them. Oh, I'm trying to take their cycle out. Um, but I really want them for Thanksgiving. Like it's very much like a part of my holiday in my mind. I know I could get like sweet potatoes and have those be better, but I'm not a sweet potato person. Okay, women. <laughs> Do you do this? I've seen so many TikToks of this. Turn on the light. Instead of actually taking it out to the recycle, we just, just toss it. <laughs> I have to step over it to go back to the car, so I'm gonna have to take care of it eventually. Anyway, we are back home. We're gonna have some lunch. Are you gonna have these meatballs? Yeah, and salad. Are they, is this a red sauce or a sweet and sour sauce? Find out. I think red sauce. Abby's one request this morning was goldfish. She's so funny. When she gets a hunkering for something, she's like, if I don't have it that day, she's like, hankering. Hankering, hunkering, hunker down. Sorry. Hankering. <laughs> <laughs> 
Anyway, she, she'll come home from school and if I don't have goldfish, she's like, Mom, I'm kind of disappointed in you. I mean, you heard her shade in the car when she was like, Mom, you don't actually cook. <laughs> so if I didn't come home with uh, goldfish, then she's gonna kind of read me the riot act, but I'm gonna put it into a little container so that everyone has access to it. How many parents would say that you need to have a locked pantry? Like a separate one. Like this one is fair game for the most part, but then having a separate one, because we just counted four open containers, little the little baggies of Ritz crackers. They don't seal back up four open containers, and yet they still go and get more from the garage. You need to have a lock. You need to have a whole pantry unit out in the garage, and there's a lock on it, code, whatever, and they can't access it until all the I also said that I was gonna do like a little charcuterie board with all the open crackers and snacks. Look at this. We have, an, oh, that's nice. <laughs> Cause that's what happens. That's why I all know, this crap I is know. here. Like so one, two, three Ritz crackers, some Cheez-Its. Like what else is open down here? Oh, a potato from, ho from homecoming. Cause that's gross. This man, we won't say family members, but this man, doesn't like to clean his egg, but no, well, I, I nah, do clean it. I no, do clean it. you do not clean it. His I version, it. I wipe nah, it out. you he wipes it out with a Your paper towel. Of clean is just different. It's ready to go. It's clean. It's sanitary. It's not sanitary. In the comments below, if you were to cook eggs in a pan and then wipe it out with a paper towel, no dish soap, no scrubbing at it, no nothing. Wipe it out. I with scrub. It. No, no. Is that sanitary or the equivalent of putting eggs on the counter, cooked eggs on the counter for 24 hours and it's coming back and saying that that's, I don't care. It's still raw. It's still egg on the pan. A certain family oh. member, a certain family member has been known to cut raw meat with a knife and then wipe said knife, knife off with dish towels from the stove and then put said knife back in drawer and then take that dirty towel with the raw meat blood on it and hang it back up. That's where these tendencies come from and he doesn't understand that he's getting these tendencies in his 40s. <laughs> That's not good. No comment. He never has a comment about this. Never. I'm trying to enjoy my... No. my okay, go and enjoy lunch. your lunch. Go and enjoy no. your lunch. Enjoy lunch together? No. He's already on the computer. There's no enjoying lunch together. So you wanna know what happens when it's the wife who's doing all the editing for her YouTube channel? You end up with half of your video without content because that's what I have been doing is editing my Christmas tree setup video. I have gotten some dinner for Ashley and it's prepped for Chelsea out there. She had to stay after school for the first time today and make up a test and rode the activity day or the activity bus home. And man, it got her home so late, got her home at 5 p.m. And it doesn't drop her off by her house. It's just, anyway, now we know when it drops off. And so we're gonna go and wait at the stop for her if she has to do it again. But she was like freezing cold because she had short shorts on and I'm tall saw. I don't know why she wore shorts. She's a hot kid, but it's pouring rain out there. So luckily Jason was waiting and he picked her up. She's freezing cold. So she hopped in the shower and then, um, I haven't really seen the teenagers. So I can hear them. That must be Chelsea up there. Uh, anyway, that's kind of it for today because now it's like nearing bedtime. It's not really, it's only, it's only 5.30. I'm feeling like it's eight o'clock. Oh goodness. I'm not really hungry because we had a late lunch, but I'm gonna get dinner soon. I don't know, it just takes a lot to do these videos. I watch other like families and who edits and who does the work or whatever. And a lot of the time it's the husband and they get dedicated time in the morning and no one has to bother them and they don't have to do dishes and laundry and take the kids to all the things. And it's like, I have to do all the things and find time to do do this so it's like anyway that's just what I've been doing and we'll see if we do anything else exciting before the end of the night I doubt it but see if Jason has any antics by the end of the day all right so I'm getting my dinner warmed up here but well, we're gonna play cover your ass cover your assets Four people? Yeah. Four people, five cards each. If you guys have not played this game yet, it's quite fun. I highly recommend it. This is what it looks like. Every <laughs> time I have the camera on near you. Do you do it on purpose? <laughs> no, I just drink water. Wait, Ash. 
Okay, so if you haven't played this game and you need <laughs> game ideas for your kids, your grandkids, yourself, like this is what we play when Jason and I go and hang out with friends. So I highly recommend it. Um, but I'm gonna eat my dinner while we play. It's just Chelsea and Ashley. Abby's up doing homework and Kaylee is saying goodbye to her boyfriend. Dude, it's only six o'clock. <laughs> it seriously feels like it's nine o'clock. So dark out. Okay, let me kind of show you a little bit of how we played this game. We're gonna show them the little stages of this game. So the idea is that you are collecting assets. These are little piggy banks and you're collecting them two by two. So you have one and then you start collecting them again, two by two and you stack them up rotating like this. And then what you do is you can, is it my turn? Yeah. No, it's my turn. Oh no, it's Is Ashley's it Ashley's turn? turn? Yeah, I'm trying to think. And then, so if you want, you can challenge them. If you have that same card. I can challenge him. You can challenge him. Um, and then that stack will then have more cards in it. And so then you're, you're covering your assets. You're building up your assets within the thing. And as soon as we have someone that has a lot of a stack, I can show you that in a second. All right, so like this, I can challenge dad mm. for his log cabin. Oh, daddy's bringing out the big buck. And this I is will- This silver to challenge. I will pass. <laughs> <laughs> My videographer had a gogurt hanging out of her mouth while she was trying to film. Thanks for the effort, boo. I got on my pants. It's okay, you're already yeah. dirty. <laughs> she got Whoa! One. That's why Chelsea hasn't been able to play. Because this is all she has. Well, I had all four cards, so that's why I had to keep Yes, I know. Oh, wow. like, yeah. okay, so Whoa. That's it. That's got like every gold. Uh, okay. Let's go for it. I'm so going this has I need three then. All you got to go. Okay. Oh, she's oh, so you don't get cards. three cards. Okay, so this one's oh, yeah. quiet. Okay, so this pile right here is what we like to call a honey bucket. Honey pile? I don't honey know. Pot, money pocket. Whatever. Money pot. Money so pot. it has all of those in it. So now this little stack, this is what is going to be stolen. This is gonna get passed around. Uh, yeah. <laughs> and, oh my gosh. Because it's worth a lot. It's worth a lot, and mm -hmm. so now everyone's gonna want that. <laughs> Every time you turn it to me, it's gonna be just me burping. <laughs> Guess who is the winner? Wow. You guys, That's let me show you lovely. this this pot that I managed to keep and move and yeah. let me hey, show you. Okay, so I had those two and then I'll show you my big pot here. Then I had these guys. Those are worth a lot. And I had a couple of these guys. I just had two of those guys. There's cars. Yep, but look how many. We're going to, okay, I we're going to. every single silver and gold. Nope. Not every, I have one. You have, you have one. one. And then I had both penny jars and another silver. So there's only one other silver over there. That's insane. <laughs> uh, I've never seen that before. Good job, hon. I can only win Technically, like Technically, you should be thanking me. I'm the one who gave her that. <laughs> yeah, we all you gambled. You create it. We gambled a little early and she paid off there. Yeah. yeah. So now this little hyper one's gonna have to go get some melatonin. Tutabella. Gosh, this girl's oh gosh, wired. She's wired. Okay, let's go get her to bed. And Chelsea has, over here, over here. Yeah? Chelsea has a test that she's gonna study for, correct? It's open note, but like, I still Still test. You gotta learn your notes. Yep. So we are gonna call it good for tonight. <laughs> Tell us to Yeah, I'm. I'll go deal with Ashley. No, you... no, no. What? You help her I with math. Even, I, can, I don't have the ability to do math tonight. <laughs> Unless you either. actually don't know how to do it, then. <laughs> I mean, that's <laughs> probably the case. So she's not actually solving the problem. She's just going over her notes. She needs to go get in the shower and okay. calm down. Does that mean all you're going to do is sit on the couch and then tell her what to do? It means I'm going to get her in the shower and get her to brush her teeth and in pajamas. You're going to stand there and make sure she brushes them? Are you serious? She comes down here and I watch her brush her teeth. Can you turn the camera on? You're going to be a good parent? Such a douche. <laughs> He's not allowed to be behind the camera. <laughs> Good night, everyone. As you can hear, we have pretty hyper kids. They literally had a candy cane like this big. This is why we don't do sodas and sugar on school nights. Take care. See you guys later. All right, so you'll see all of the talk about my pan, but look at the pan that Dana just did. Oh, look at all that grease. Right there, not taken care of. Oh, it's scandalous.
笑>一生に一回。<笑>